This last year has been the hardest year certainly I've ever seen in the church. When you combine this global pandemic with the racial strife, with especially the political situation in the United States, it's really driven many churches apart. Even in my own congregation, I know that we've lost hundreds of members. We think that now is exactly the time when all around the world, Christians need to rediscover why the church is essential. Our Christianity needs to take a church shape. It needs to be family-ified. It needs to be body-ified, flock-ified. God's vision for Christianity is a corporate vision, a people vision. I see a lot of people excited actually about virtual church, online church, how we can reach more people through that media. The problem is God's plan for the church is not virtual. Through virtual church, through an internet preacher, you can get the gospel declared, but it's in the actual gathered church you get the gospel displayed. So I, I can declare to you, while we were yet sinners, Christ died for us. But it's when I get together with you and we sin against one another and forgive one another, we display that gospel. It's actually normal to be frustrated by church. It's normal to be frustrated by other Christians. I would actually go so far as to say that that frustration is part of the sanctification process that God intends for us. All the inconveniences, all the messiness of the actual church that we perceive when we gather together, that we, we avoid through virtual church. No, those are the very things that God means to grow us and conform us to his own loving image in the display of the gospel. The gathered assembly of the church is essential. It is not incidental to our faith. I think if we rediscover that vision for the church, it's going to be new for a lot of people, it's going to be exciting for a lot of people, and it can really revolutionize people's experience of church.